Hey everyone, uh, this is William Tut Kid. Um, today I'm going to show you the um, Predator Chrome effect. It's like you're invisible. It's um pretty cool. Um, and while Sony Vegas is loading, I'm going to tell you if you don't have the video footage for this, um, mm -hmm. I am having all my projects for every single video. In my, on my website, you can download them in the. There's a link in the sidebar, and if you're worried I have a virus, I'll always have the link through Norton Safe Web, which um, Norton Antivirus um, conducts a website that scans every single website for malicious files. All right, um, this time I'm going to be using actually the project file that you guys are going to be using if you're downloading what I'm using. Um, it's going to be project 2.wma if you want it. Um, let me tell you that there is no sound. Alright. Well, as you can tell, I'm making a complete fool of myself. But, um, that's a completely different story. So first we got to, um, take out the green screen. Um, I've already set a preset for this. Um, so... I'm just kind of speeding ahead, making it a little easier for you guys, a little faster. So let me go into my preset. It's Tutorial Chroma. If you want it, um, there's the stuff. Go ahead. Take it. Okay. So we're at the very beginning. And for some reason, it's not exactly where I wanted it. Hmm. So kind of take out parts that are showing there and put the photo down around and now I'm going to put in a video I mean a picture I use this picture actually for the video I did on this and the chroma is a lot better because I used a completely different program for this. I don't like Sony Vegas's Chroma Mountains. It's I just never have liked it. It's not good to me. And I'll have some effects, some tutorials on the um, program I use too. Alright, so you're going to have your, well me, on a um, mountaintop. Pretty amazing, I guess. I'm going to be dancing. Go into your, okay. Uh, if you want to make this all good, I mean, I know some people do. You're going to wait for me to snap. I just wanted to see if you guys would like that. Uh, so move that down, take that down, and um, just edit me out of my. I was a little lazy and didn't do that. So you're gonna have two separate tracks. Go into custom. And go into height map. Add, okay. You're gonna get that weird blob. No one likes blobs. Wrap pixels around. It's your first step. And you're gonna take the smoothness down. Depending on how well you want it. I mean you can get it really weird or like just like totally on drugs. <laughs> and this is one of those effects where you really do have to just play around with it and there's no real set look to it because you can you everything can change you it's just pretty much your image for it so um just play with it you can make it really liquidy or you can make it really weird or trippy that's my new favorite word i'm gonna start saying that trippy um that's pretty much the tutorial if you guys want to see it um oh yep I forgot something. Okay. Um, if you want to, you don't have to. You can um, put a fade on this and then um, bring it out like so. And yes, it does come out and then put the fade in. And it, I guess it does something. It just makes it a little smoother. But considering Sony Vegas is being a narwhal, it's not working for me. So your next step is to render it. Thank you.